Oh yes, we better put that wrist strap on. If you saw Excite Truck, this is the sequel to that, except it's way more ridiculous. The gimmicks are kind of off the charts, and I'm pretty sure this was marketed to kids and I don't really care. The main fun's still here, or at least I'm, I find fun in it still. <laughs> I kind of like some of the gimmicks. We are going to start with a blank file. I was looking through here and I got S's on everything. But, uh... Name it this. Look at all these symbols I could put on my profile. How about the axe? That's safe. Alright, hey Cheap Hot Man, hey Jesse, hey Emma. Let's show you how this game works. Of course, like before, there's Excite and Super Excite, but... And a whole bunch of tracks to go through. We don't even start with Bronze, we start with School Cup, but it's not even gonna really teach us anything. There's Training? I could go through the training. It's pretty much the same as the other, but let's just do it, I guess. Why not? Driving. Oh my, we're starting at the real basics. Pretty much the same controls. Gas with two. Tilt. Gotta have them motion controls. I'd hate to feel in control of what I was doing. Ah, somehow past that. Turbo, because we gotta go fast. Like Excite Truck, there's a gauge in the lower right, and if you overfill your turbo, you overheat. It's a lot easier to overheat, I think, in the other game, though. Um, it lasts a lot longer here. Airborne, tilt backwards to fly farther and faster? What do you mean, fly faster? By tilting backward. I don't believe it. If you tilt it back too much, you'll stall. I thought this was a tutorial on how to jump. It didn't tell me how to jump, did it? You just boost. Spin for style. Boost on the jump. I don't know why you keep thinking you're first, Mr. Cabs. You're not first. Oh, turbo jump. Well, I'm making up this tutorial, thinking it's this. Your third. Third's good. Tap the turbo button as you take off from a jump to get extra air and get points. Because, of course, this game's all about getting points. Not winning races. You get points for winning races, but the point is the points. While doing ridiculous crap. Air spin. Earn stars by spinning your bot around in the air. This is actually kind of an early spot to put this in the tutorial, I think. But, again, the controls are funky. You hold one, you hold brake, and then... And you have to hold the turbo, and then you spin it. I don't even spin it the direction it's showing. <laughs> Maybe next time, Mr. Fish, I thought about it. We're gonna play something ridiculous instead. That's it. I guess the rest you'll have to learn on your own. How to earn points. They really didn't tell you how to earn points. Not very well. All right, off to Mexico. So yes, we have a frog. And it, um, we have a few animals, bugs, whatever, unlocked. But you have to earn stars to get more. And even playing through this entire game, getting S's on everything, couldn't unlock much. They apparently really want you to play the hell out of this game. Frog yellow. Alright, show you some of the stuff we'll be actually doing. So they use the uh, the same tracks as Excite Truck. There's a few more locations in here, though. Alright, the red bar. So every stage has a red bar, and it's pretty much a complete waste of time. You just rotate the remote in a circle ten times. I wish that wasn't in here, but you know you live with some things. It's worth a lot of points, but it'll penalize you if you try to go past it. Get some points from being in the air, from spinning in the air, from doing a drift. 
We're playing a tambourine now because that's what this game's about. So here's this red bar. Everyone has to stop here and go around it. Okay, I'm not doing an airspin so I can drift and grab that. You know, I think the game audio is probably still really loud. I'm turning it down just a bit. Let me know how it is. Probably not going to have too much trouble getting S points in this, I hope. It's one lap and I've already pretty much got 75. Yeah, it's definitely the same but different. There's a lot more gimmicks going on. I think this is a random gimmick, it's not always the tambourine. Nope, not the tambourine again. Just have to hit the A button twice. It's just ridiculous. Hey, bloody Vanessa. Ridiculous is the point, though. <laughs> What the hell is that? I don't even know. Smoke. I can't turn while doing the air spin. It's the only negative about it. It's worth it. There's also a finish flag at the end of every course if you can get there first and grab it. It's worth five points, but first is worth 50. Probably beat that 75. 75, this. I think just like Excite Truck, the score that it shows you, the target score, is just for a B. Yeah. Wouldn't want to know what I actually want to get. There. Now you know what you're in for. PG. Yeah, all of these locations were in Excite Truck. I kind of like the look of Fiji in this game. Now, the the most fun thing to do in Excite Truck, well, I should talk about these yellow bars first. You spin around fast and then there's a timing to it to release. You can actually release faster, it's just harder to do it. I usually just wait for the time it pretty much makes it seem like it wants you to release. Hey, Timothy. Hi, John Cool. We're about to do some bowling. How did I know that was there? <laughs> One point per pin. Why not? I like the five star things. Just something to grab. There's just so much more to do in this one. But I would say the, the most fun way to earn points in Excite Truck were tree runs. And they're way harder to do in this game. Just, I would go out of my way to just go run by trees in the other game. And you really can't do that. No, I should have jumped at the other spot. One nice thing is when you crash, you only have to shake the remote to get going again. In the other game, you had to press A really fast. Got a little tiring. I definitely like the other one better, but I still like this one. Where's all the bars? I thought there were more yellow bars here. That's no strike. <laughs> the bowling pin was there? It flew that far? But yeah, I kinda hate the red bar. I just put up with it. Ooh, I got one star for that going between those trees. 
Yeah, worth it it is. Oh, I got tree points and I didn't even know it was happening. Oh, I missed the stars. Well, we better be getting first in this class of racing, I think. Almost 300 points. Stars. Off to Canada, which was my favorite place in Excite Truck. There's still a few tree runs in this game, which you can just get a ridiculous number of points from. Um, you see in a different number than I am, Timothy. I see double that. All right, here's a new gimmick. You grab a wrench, all of a sudden your vehicle turns upright and starts walking. And you actually have to tilt the controller like there's feet on both ends. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Well, everyone just refresh for fun, I guess. There's the wrench. You can also crash into other cars and get points while you're up like this. And yeah, nothing to explain there. Nothing weird about that. I see lots of trees, but I'm gonna crash. Yeah, this, this, uh, denture you set down and it goes and attacks someone. <laughs> I don't care. I really don't care. Kind of empty space here. Like, I'm, I want to go by the trees, but I get almost nothing for it. And I miss the wrench. Hey, there's a super tree run. Finally. Eleven. This game makes you freaking earn it. <laughs> All I saw was... I can't use this yet because of the red bar coming up. Is that a robot frog with wheels for feet? Yes. Yes, it is. Playing a tambourine. While flying through the air. <laughs> this is just the game for being on the The perfect game for it. Or being on anything else. Doubled that target store score, so that better be an S. We are in school cup after all, so. Better be getting S's. How about Finland? The track to always worry about in the other game. As soon as I get enough stars, I'm switching to the... The animal I usually pick in this is a hummingbird. I don't know why. I have no reason. Glider flying. If you're walking, you can go off a ramp and, well, glide. And collect butterflies. <laughs> I'm not making anything up. You forgot this game exists? I'm more surprised you knew the game existed. Mash. Two points. We're gonna throw a dart. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, I actually overheated. Hang on, Tedrick. 
Alright, time to try out that gliding, huh? Butterflies are worth a lot of points, they're five each. So this is worth 20. Please don't hit the tree. Okay, this is a different gimmick up here. Flip the remote sort of around while you're in the air and I never really seem to know how to do that one. Three times gets you the five points. If you flip while you're going through the rope on the way down though, you just go through it. Now we're playing soccer. I didn't make the game. Even though the water, I think, will lower your temperature gauge all the way, I think I avoid it because it's really hard to steer. Like, you pretty much just keep going straight, like real ice. Sometimes when you do the dart and stuff, other paths open. Because the game's nuts. close. usually just don't want to do it too much because I don't want to miss the whole points. I am pretty sure I was in high school when I first played this. Random thought, maybe. It's not 300 points, but it'll do. Got 40 butterfly points, you know. Can excel for butterfly point excellence. I rise of Axel. The school cup is over. Now for the real game. Which isn't much different than what we just did, but hey. Egypt. This one's new. Was not a location in Excitrek. Nice, because I transformed the terrain and the bots were over where they were, where that was, they all threw. Got thrown in the air. Points. This thing I don't even understand. You light it on fire and you fly and you get air points. I don't even know what the hell it is. Okay, the water will, like, paralyze you. There's always a five star next to it. And this, if you're flying high enough, you can wait for the spin to award you points and then spin more. But if you keep spinning, you won't get extra points. Rings. Remember these? Well, they exist. And they are exactly the same. But you almost never see them now. Because there's so much other stuff going on. Thank you. 
if that's a hack or something, then I'm probably not interested. Yes, it's a frog. <laughs> For now, it's a frog. Get right into a tree. But as long as you give me those points, I don't really care. Oh, I was trying to be next to trees. If you have a computer, kind of... What kind of statement is if you have a computer? Oh, I didn't get the flag, but who cares? Plenty of points. Got up this difficulty. Scotland, the place where trees live. The hummingbird is available, and that's the one I usually use, but it costs double the stars that I have, and we're moving forward. Maybe by the time I've got the frog to ten races, because it tracks. In 1981. Probably through 2000, it made sense. Well, that's when I first got an actual computer at home. Myself, anyway. Wasn't paying attention. There's a few tree run points, but you gotta be so close to them in this game. And it's not like the steering is really tight. <laughs> yes. They've they're they're smaller than a house. So much for mainframes. Ugh, I tried to tilt to the left so I'd be closer to the trees. For points. I'm actually not in first. That's shocking too. Yeah, that was a hammer. I don't ask questions, you don't ask questions. Steering is not that easy. Still not five points from trees. Like, man, am I trying to get some? Walls at the nests. Back to Mexico already, we're already repeating. I think this works kind of like Excite Truck did, in that there's one big course, but then there's different paths that each track is through that course. I want to say that. What turn? Points are worth it, though. See ya, Timothy. I can get some tree points over here. Not many. There's a path that was down there to the left, though, still.
So there's three laps on this one. Nice, you can like turn really tight. That made that worth it and not slow me down much. Oh, the tornado. Hmm. I want to try to go over here. But I still pretty much jumped over it. Yeah, it wasn't worth it. Thought that was a computer player, but it still said I was in first. Look at all those stars. I'm gonna try to get to those. I went all the way over the stars. Wait, is that actually gonna- that's actually gonna go all the way to that car? Not quite. It wasn't stopping, though. Certainly could've got more out of that. China. Now new stuff again. I think the music on this stage is like super techno. That I probably liked at first and now less. <laughs> Minus this part. That was never good. <laughs> and here a little bit of Xena. Yes, that is a glove. Trying to smash me. <laughs> the trucks. Well, marketing, that's why they turned into frogs. I think the trucks with all the gimmicks wouldn't have fit, too. Um, I keep looking for a side road. I saw there was a side road there, but it wasn't the kind I meant. Probably a different course I'm thinking of. A different version of China. These toys, toy, no, no, these are not toys in stores that I don't know of. Probably would have been a little bit cool. I wouldn't have got them, but maybe someone would have. not over here and miss that. Can I get three points? Oh, it's bad to crash right next to the bar because it usually puts you back really far. And this is the second lap too. Not the best time to be behind.
Yeah, third place. 200 points should be enough, though. Ninja Turtle car racing. There is a turtle. By that in a heartbeat. Kilimanjaro. Oh no. Too far from the bar. Every time the path splits, I feel like you have to memorize where to go, and I don't like that. One way I'm sure has more points to get than another. Okay, the big stars are five, the others are one. Kinda. Okay, here's a tree run. So it's usually good to slow down a little bit in these. That's not bad. That's bad. Oh, I still hit the marker thing. Trigger. I don't even see another ramp. Oh, Out of control. Okay, this tube thing sort of lifts you in the air and you get air points while you're in it, but it's kind of silly. Everything's silly, so... Once you start drifting, it's hard to stop because it's so many points. Kind of quick points. Oh, if I would have went into them, I would have crashed them and got five points each. It's painful being that close. Yes, butterflies. So the tar, I think, just overheats you instantly. I don't think it kills you. Or crashes you. Nothing kills you. Now we're playing baseball, and I missed. Just like real baseball. So once the tornado gets you, you pretty much just push forward and you get out of it. Damn it. Missing the bar, but missing the bar also puts me ahead a little bit. No, no, there's no story at all. There's no reason for anything happening. There are points to get. That's it. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, if you're gonna give me points, <laughs> it's hard to argue. On the air, I can hardly see where the track is. Nice. Oh, that triggered another path. Kind of like Frogger. Um, I want to say I did play that? The PS1 Frogger? At some point? Forever ago? It's not like the Super Nintendo one, which is awful, is it? It's like a completely different thing. It sounds familiar. I mean, of course Frogger sounds familiar, but that version being different sounds familiar. Yes, it was very nice, Tambourine.
Nothing to explain there. Just throwing pies into clowns' faces. This is what happens in every racetrack across America. I mean, don't you remember lap? It's it's a tradition in NASCAR at lap 73. Uh, they throw a pie into clowns' faces. 411. <laughs> Hi, Lion. Yes, yes. Just a clown, and it's 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 all normal. <laughs> this is the sequel to Excite Truck, which ramped the gimmicks up to ridiculous. Yeah, next cup. <laughs> yes, it is. Yes, it is. I almost can unlock the stupid hummingbird, which is the one I usually use. <laughs> Imagine just opening the stream, and first thing you hear is the clown laugh. I had a feeling that's what happened. Oh, we don't want to go by them. We want to run through them. I think there's a bar up here. Yeah. Except I didn't jump, so I couldn't reach it. I mean, you can see the game works like Excite Truck, but there's just crap everywhere. <laughs> I don't think it's normal to know this is a thing. Oh, I didn't hit the trees. I still don't get... It's so hard to get tree run points in this game. Which is my favorite thing of Excite Truck, which is why I definitely like that better. Oh, well, the ball was nowhere near. I mean, the core fun of the game is at least still here. As much as when you're playing, you're like, what in hell am I doing? Oh, that's actually open. I think that opens in the first lap. The mine shaft there. And pay attention. I mean, I'm 100% sure this game was made for kids. <laughs> But luckily, I played the first one first. I wonder why they didn't make another. Oh, 24, damn. In this game, that's amazing. Nice, that felt really good. Forty five tree runs on this track. Well, it actually had a couple spots with tree runs, which it's only been two times that's been true. Back to China. Can I get the hummingbird? I can get the hummingbird now. Why the hummingbird's better, I don't really know. I just picked the hummingbird for no good reason. Now, if you want a color, you gotta pay for those too, because we want to make sure you play this game for at least 6,000 hours. I mean, this hummingbird looks way better than the frog, doesn't it? Okay, I think there's a place you can go through, like, the bamboo trees. I don't know what to call them. What it looks like to me. Probably still a different version of the track. I have so much trouble doing that one, and I don't really know why. I still say this red bar is the worst thing in this game, just because it completely stops everything you're doing. 
If somehow you're enjoying everything else that's happening. Nothing on the wall on this one. I just feel like I have nothing to say about that. Everything in the blue box, box is just half ignored. Just, oh, here's where I was looking at before. Oh, wow, I actually went through there. When you're walking with the wrench, you have to, like, wa waggle the remote left and right. Like you're act like it's actually walking. So it's you actually end up steering left and right alternate or alternatingly. And it's... Really hard to control. Almost another extra hundred points. How much is the color? Oh, a thousand. I think some of the colors. Yeah, why? Why is black ten thousand? Not saving up for black. I'll go for orange. Guess. The best part of this game is pretty much the best part of Excite Truck, which is when there's a really long tree run section. Here's a little tree run section. Just actually steering through it. There's just way less of them in this. <laughs> if I have a choice, give me the trees. Trigger that from the other thing? Maybe. It likes to usually split paths into threes. I didn't even know this was a tree run. Slow here isn't a bad thing. Well, oh, good. I was going fast enough to at least get the points. <laughs> he just vomited rocks. The skeleton vomited rocks. put you back a lot when you crash by the red bar. That's just the time to let everyone else in front of you. Go this way. For no reason. Oh, trees. That take third. Third and an S. I'd rather earn points from doing all the other crap anyway. What the 
hell out of my way. Or stay in my way so I can crash into all of you. Six times. <laughs> Did I just jump off telephone wires? Who even knows? I think there's a tree run to the right, but it's... I don't remember if it's worth it. Oh, it's just really tight. Wow, I made it through there. I didn't hit a single tree. No, not down there. Crash. Crash, please. No, crash. Crash. Everyone's getting ahead. At least they're slow. Let's just take the regular way. The rings look so normal compared to everything else. I usually find that kind of hard to line up. First time we see a field goal. In a little of every sport in this. I'm sure kids, all kids have done Things like that. Can't remember myself. Hit the tree! I just want. Maybe I'll just go forward and hope I just catch up. Well, first place is first place. One more for silver. I felt like if I could just kept spinning, I would have been so far off track. Truck now. Hot throw is accidental points. Accidental points. All right, I think we're about to see the weirdest thing in this game. Not this. Super sandwich. <laughs> no comment. Not a damn comment. Oh, I went all the way around him. A hummingbird rotating around pole thing horizontal, collecting parts of a sandwich. And if you miss one part, you only get one point. Because screw you. There's no cheese on this. This isn't a sandwich. I hate the sandwich too. Not even a good sandwich. What? I crashed! How did I crash? While transforming, you'll 
just die instantly? We don't even get the frickin' butterflies. That hurts a lot. In the distance, it looked like this token, this, what, I don't even know what to call it. It looked like it was off the road. I can tell you, I'm not getting a sandwich. What if I just go this way? Uh... You die. That's what happens. Stay ahead. At least a second. Relax, Tedrick. I, I think it's just baloney. It was a pun, and it, well, it, I didn't even mean it to be. But I sure think the obstacle's baloney. Ah, just a little behind first. But over 100 points more than we needed for the B, so... Uh, I guess it depends on if you're sleeping within three hours. All S's. Just going right along. I definitely am not going to play past um, the Platinum Cup. Game overload. <laughs> like 90 minutes, I think, is like my tolerance for this. What's over here? Things I can miss. Like, have they already shrunk the rings? Like, I see trees, but they're not very close together. Where you can actually get points from them. This game really punishes you when you get hit, when you crash. It can put you back really far sometimes, but sometimes that's good. Especially if you're put back at a part where you can get a lot of points. There's a couple tree runs that it does that to you at. Which is kind of nice. Awesome, there. Finally ran into a car. This is a tree run, I remember. Go slow. Nice. That's awesome. That's like the best thing ever. Remix from something? I don't know if I've heard this in any other game. It'd be hard for me to be surprised at that, though. Oh, a real song. Those, those things.
What the hell? <laughs> but I get five points for someone smashing into me. How about... No, this is the way I went the first time. I didn't crash, like, the first time, though. Those air spins are worth so many points. <laughs> I have more of the opposite problem, like, sometimes. I'm weird, though. Yes! It Steering is not that easy in this game, I just want to say. Again. I haven't taken that path I saw on the left either time. We're in the lead this lap, at least. The one that matters. I think that's enough points. Three sixty-five. And the target for our B was two hundred sixty-one tree run points. Oh yeah, that was Tasmania. I forgot about Tasmania. It's disgusting how many bots there are and how much they all freaking cost. If you actually want to use them. As much as they matter. I guess you assume a kid playing this probably won't be getting S's for a while. Um, I don't think I'm supposed to be going this way. At least I got some tree run points. For going not quite on the road. near the trees at all. <laughs> I want to go this way. Is that okay? Is that okay, game? I guess it's not. Another tree run over here, though. Yeah, we do. Nope. First tree you hit, you get no more points. I'm pretty sure that's a spot I will go backwards to go and do again, though. I think it, uh, the time limit on this one is five minutes, and it's only two laps, and the first lap took a minute fifty. Yeah, I've definitely done that. I'm already over the 150, though. I don't think there's a road this way. Well, that's how you're supposed to do it. <laughs> Didn't reach the bar. I'm in third. 
much as that should matter. Really trying to edge to those trees. Okay, stop. I want to go this way. No, that's fast. Where did he even put me? Farther than I was. Now let's let's contemplate which way to go. Well, this wasn't the way I was thinking I was choosing from. That is again. Awesome. That would be easier to do without the wrench. But yep, I'm going backwards, even though I've got double the points for the B-score. I don't really care. I just want to do it again. When was this here? Oh, I didn't go far enough. Okay, whatever. 317 is probably good. Air spin 73. I mean, how do you just not do them if you know they exist? There better be some trees in Scotland. At least there have been tree runs in the last few levels. Horses. Yes. This is actually modeled exactly off of one of the old tracks. Oh. Started good. Knock some bowling pins over. No big deal. Back to racing. Path over there. Of course, why wouldn't they go this way? Did I hit a tree? I didn't think I did, but apparently so. What? Why isn't it going? That first place was so far ahead of me, but they swung so wide, it completely caught up. I'm pretty sure to the left is a sandwich, so I'm sure as hell not going that way. The POW from Excite Truck. It's the first time we've even seen one, and it still screws you just in this game as much as the first. Oops. You have to actually release with timing. Right between the boxes. I can't get away with just jumping above the trees in this game like I can the other one. No, I want more. Oh, wow. That actually worked. There's a way, right? Yeah. And there's some trees, too. Could not see that it was angling right. 
Hi, my name is Jeff. It sure is Excitebots. You know about this game? You love it more than any other Wii game? I definitely like Excite Truck better, but I still don't dislike this. It was on my favorites list. Awesome, there, I didn't hit a tree. I've never heard anyone say that, <laughs> ever. I always like the hummingbird. Mexico. Hey, I can buy orange for way too much money. Hey, Green Fuzz. I almost played something else, but decided not to. <laughs> sure you know what that was. Probably still should have. <laughs> I figured I'd played Excite Truck. And I talked about the sequel, and now I'm showing what it is. I'm pretty sure that spoiler's okay, Jeff. I'm good with that. <laughs> spoilers in this game, I don't think matter. Maybe just keep the last track alone, if anything. But if you saw the first game, then it's not really a surprise. It takes a long time to turn after you stop doing air spins. So if I wanted to get that over there, I would have had to stop sooner. Through the trees. Oh wow, that didn't hurt. Oh hell yes. Roach, I've been having some ant problems. Minor ant problems, luckily. I don't mean sisters of parents. Wow, I went through that? I see trees, I have to try. I have to try to tilt over here. Yes, the trucks are all animals of some kind. And the gimmicks are off the charts. But it's still all about earning a target score. Yeah, I've got all S ranks on another file that's on here. I didn't want to delete it. Although I'm probably going to end up with it if I keep playing the game. I have played this game in Excite Truck so many times through. A little ridiculous. Stuff in this game costs so much to unlock, though, if you actually are just good at the game. That's still a lot. Nice. And a bonus one for the road. What? I crashed? Sure. Come on, give me some points. Tried to angle it right at the last second. <laughs> Dizzy? Yes. That's not surprising. I think it'll make it. Yes, just like Excite Truck. Crashes give you a point. Nice first, but then they passed me after the line. 
The soccer thing is kind of hard to do because you have to hit it at a certain angle. You can kind of adjust it last second, but it's tricky. 79 tree run points. That's a ton in this game. Tree runs are so much harder to do in this than the Excite Truck. I will keep saying it. Guatemala. This one might be one of the harder ones. We're on regular difficulty still, though. Also known as way too easy mood. Uh oh. I can't turn! I can't turn at all. Cannot turn at all. Get a field goal, make presence appear. Oh, I went over there. Come back, everyone. Why are you all together in a pack? If it did something, the rock over there would not have been there. <laughs> Bam! It was just sitting there. Oh, there's a tree run to the left. Bowling one's not bad. It's usually easy to get in that, even if you don't take the way it wants you to go that way. Ah, oh, when you're not in first, others can wreck your bowling setup. Well, this is barren. Oh yeah, definitely want the 20 point butterfly over anything. There's a trigger over there. Do I just go over here? Okay, cool, you just go over there and it opens. There's only two laps. I actually kind of probably need points. Kind of intentional. Oh, it didn't really work like I wanted it to. Not at all. Time limit's 5.15 and this is at 3 minutes, so I could go backwards. Seems like a good opportunity too. If you can make it all the way back to the red bar, you will repeat the red bar. Which is a good thing. Yay, a point. <laughs> I tried very hard to get points. I don't think this is working. I do already have S rank. I don't know what the numbers are for that. So if you say that, I believe you. I wish I'd feel better with one more point.
That one will be harder next time. S rank on gold. One more cup. What we are doing now. This one's three laps. I'm pretty sure. Well, that was close. There's a bar down here and up there because you can get on top of the wall. I was hoping I was just close. Well, this is awful. There. My friend likes to call the glove the hamburger helper glove. Well, let's try another lap and hope it goes better. The one over there, though. Oh, it's just here. Straight into the trees. Oh, I was hoping I'd be just like straight lined with them. Want trees? I cannot help it. The most fun I can have in this game is the trees. You never went on the wall? <laughs> if you knew how to make your Wii work. <laughs> That's a personal problem. Yeah, I'm playing on a Wii U right now, mainly for capturing because this is HDMI. Yeah. Oh, there's a sub there was a path to the right. That wasn't bad. Five minutes, I'm in fourth. Just go. Just freaking go. Well, super tree runs are certainly the most fun. Yeah, I'm going backwards once. They give you so much time sometimes. It's hard not to. You can't earn points while you go backwards, though.
Nice. Just so satisfying to do it. Over the bar and under the stars, I think 300 will do. Who needs placing? Who needs points from that? Just a few more courses left and excite. Crystals. I don't know what you mean. Well, I'm pretty sure I do know what you mean. In a track. Jump combo. Kind of satisfying doing that real fast. Ah, if I'd started that sooner. You have to pull the remote up to jump at the end of that track. Hey, fish. Hey, there's a new one. You have to hit it on the red spot on the gauge on the right to catch the fish. <laughs> Two laps. Oh, this is just the red bar. It's not the finish line. There's another tree run to do and fail, maybe. These are really close together. That one's difficult. win. <laughs> yeah, I'm already over 225. Eh, down there was the fun way, but we're up here. I'm just gonna hit the football. Oh, actually me. <laughs> yes, it does move a little fast. Oh, I didn't get these last time. There's a lot going on. There's a gimmick at every turn. Three, three ninety-two. I'm pretty happy with that. I could have turned around and went for more, but it would have cost me the fifty. I'm always tempted. Almost four hundred points. Canada. That course had a lot of tree runs.
I'm pretty sure I have got 400 on one of them already. Just, I think just one. <laughs> there was one with TNTs. Snuck by to get that. Yeah, I said there was one tree run I did with TNTs. I think I usually want to try to get next to these trees, but it's just way too hard. Those are trees. Oh, I don't even want the wrench in this case. I tried to like barely move it at all. Oh, I actually crashed. It ran out. You can't crash while you're walking, usually. True turn. Well, that appeared. Let's go get it. There's some trees to the right. And a pow I don't want. Oh, that the pow actually triggers the path, though. Damn it. We'll be back. Um, the only thing that's slot machine in this is when, like, three blocks appear in front of you. One of them gives you five stars. That's what you meant? I didn't see one. Just now. Not bad. 16 points. Like, I hope there's something over here because I'm just jumping. No, 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 this is not my new favorite. Okay, I want to see, I want to see this. Yeah, the path was left. <laughs> 530. How do you know what the scores for S rank are? Okay, try to go slow. Oh, that's easier said than done. Five and a half minutes, and this is the last lap. I was in sixth anyway. So wait, the pow block is gone. The pow pow block. The pow is gone, but. Should be back after the reset, though. This one's a toughie. And keep tapping the brake. Oh, it didn't turn. Oh, I didn't hit it until after the turn back. Oh no, not the jump, but it was still a lot. 36 is the new record. Cool. Can't help it.
92 points from tree runs. Um, I liked Poker Race when I first played this game, but it's actually kind of boring. I wish there was more to it. I wish you were still doing tricks and stuff and whatever. With the Poker Race, yes. It's kind of true, Intertuber, but that was true about the original, too. Which I streamed all the way through called Excite Truck. The goal is to earn a target point value. But you get extra points if you get first. Yes, all that matters to me is super tree runs. I just feel awesome. I can't help it. I go backwards to do them. <laughs> Over sex going over those. Bar is usually an easy five points, so it's hard for me to say no to the bar. And then I do it wrong. I keep jumping over everything I want to do. Crash. Please crash. What's this? Damn it, I keep jumping right over everything. That was a long way to go for five points. Wow, those are so close together. Hey look, I jumped over another trigger. Well, that's not good. Why am I gonna go down here? Oh, I regret it now. Yes, the physics are a little weird. You're not in precise control, but you can certainly get away with more than it seems like you should. Crap, I was impatient again. Don't jump over it. Hands off the boost. Okay, I missed these before. Definitely want the butterflies. A lot of points. Physics aren't in the Constitution. <laughs> Damn it. Just go straight. I haven't seen a clown in a while. Oh, we're over here. Not a lot of points. Well, I didn't want to be playing a Metroid hack and you not know about it. It seemed wrong. It's like against the laws of the universe or something. That's all. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Hey, we made it to first. Give me that flag.
You're not there to say I'm sorry every four minutes. <laughs> we thought of the same thing at the same time. Tasmania, last course in Platinum in regular Excite. And once through, I'm sure, is going to be enough for me with this. <laughs> Ouch. I had multiple, dude. Um, well, this game's a little hectic. So, well, that's alright, Jeff. Thanks for watching while you could. That is really high. Fishing. Nope. More clowns. Well, I think I've missed. But we somehow found a way to go anyway. It's completely not worth it. five stars over there, but each butterfly is worth five. No, I ran out of momentum. I only got two. I see trees! I must stop. <laughs> this is not going well. Seriously. That's so annoying. I think if you go through the trees... Nope. There's a path down there, I know. Five, but yeah, let's go this way. Okay, a thing I don't even know, it's there. <laughs> No, he kicked it. He kicked it instead of me. Let's see if I can keep some speed this time. Yeah, there's only three of them, though. There's four in most other ones of those. I flew over the five star, even though I was using air spins, which, which should slow you down. Tree run points in places where there's not just a clear tree path is like a gift. I'm a little worried about points. And his arm is still in the way. Just try for first. Has not first. Wow, that's the first B. How about that? Every other one has been an S every time. Oh, we have to replay one. Shucks, one. First lap certainly went pretty bad, though, I thought. Whoa! 
Got five points from the other bot running into me, though. And <laughs> another. Crap. I missed it, so the wrench wasn't there. Well, I couldn't turn, so here we are. Points seem better, though. Matters more. I tried so hard to go to the left. Hey, it wasn't awake this time. Wow, that actually went in? That is, a, that is a way better score. That's just nothing in comparison to the other one. The other one was nothing. Why must I clip the wall? Go this way. Oh yeah, it's a sandwich. Of course you would. Okay, make sure I get this. I see to the H. I feel like I should try the other path. There we go, 15. Wrong way in my foot. Hey, give me some points. I'm doing this. You better reward me. Oh my god, that's huge! There was a ton there! That just kept going! I went over it? I think we might be okay this time. I'm just crashing there every time. Metroverto. Go down. Try to sneak ahead a couple places. Not that it really mattered too much. Faster and holy cow, more than a hundred more points. Yeah, I'd say that was better. Welcome to the G side. Is this I'm Monica? Is like a raid happening and I'm not even realizing it? <laughs> yes, it's very different. But if it was the same, it probably wouldn't. I don't know. I would have liked a more direct sequel to Excite Truck. I still would love a more direct sequel to Excite Truck. I mean, I think it'd fit on the Switch pretty perfect. We've just completed the main game, sort of. Excite difficulty all tracks with S rank. Which unlocks super excite. Which is all the tracks again, but harder. Yeah, I would definitely play this on Switch. It'd fit perfect. Did like five people just come here like randomly at the same time or was it actually a raid? <laughs> I feel like I missed something. Yeah, this... 
I mean, this even has a versus mode, so hopefully it would have online multiplayer somehow. Although, just racing, hopefully they'd add some different ways to play it. I don't know. I'd love it. I'd love it for a while, anyway. It is very weird, but if you get past it, um, it feels very satisfying. If you haven't played Excite Truck, I would probably say play that first. But this also feels maybe geared a little more to kids, so I don't know. Whichever appeals to you more. Now it's just a little weirdness to get past, throwing pies and clown faces, throwing darts, bowling, playing the tambourine, you know, standard stuff. And then tree runs. And then tree runs. Yep, Iwata worked on this game. I don't know if he worked on Excite Truck, honestly. I kind of like the mini games. It's just, I don't know. Overall, I don't know, but I, I, I would probably like different ones. There we go. Pilot. You can make the hummingbird a pilot if you want to freaking pay everything you have or lots and lots and lots of S's. Which obviously, why would you pay the stars? How would you pay the stars? How could you even get that many stars? Alright, so that unlocks all the tracks, but we have to do it at a higher difficulty, though. Other racers are faster, and I assume the stars would be higher. I'm pretty sure the stars are higher. Maybe we'll do one of these poker races. It's There's not much to it, but I'll do one. It's it's There's only three that I'd even track, anyway. So, this is literally making a poker hand. If it doesn't sound, if it sounds fun so far, let's just kill your expectations. Completely. This mode, I just wish there was a different way to get the cards. Pausing also. So, I can choose which card I want change out two three four seven I don't like any two three seven I don't like any of those I'll just score it so you can score your hand at any time that you have five cards two three three seven five if you're slow though other cars get your stuff Okay, there's no jack, but I'm gonna try to get one. Or we're gonna not get any. Try one more. Okay, there's a jack. Yes, the engine sound is the same. Well, hell yes, a 10. Is there a 10 in this? No. Take it. Wait. Jack 9. Nine, seven, um, I see a four. Nine, four? Nope. I don't see any of those in there. Could have maybe went for a flush. I mean, the only thing interesting here is keeping your speed up, actually doing a race at the same time. And the fact that you can score when you want. Nothing in here. You have to score at least a pair. I can't just dump them. Oh wait, it replaces the card.
Hey, we got a full house. He doesn't take it. Five chances left. There's a nine. Lots of twos. Nine, three, three. Or queen, or whatever. Okay, only two more cards. Two, three, jack. It's all bad. King. King's all I see. So the target score is 250. Apparently. First does matter. So it was actually kind of close. There's that. I think I didn't remember doing this with computer players for some reason. I don't know. I don't know why. Let's do it one more time. Why the heck not? Ace. Okay, I feel like I like this better than I remember. <laughs> Eight. Nine. Maybe a straight could have happened, but... Another nine. Unless there's another nine in this one, there's not. Six. Eight. There's an eight. Take that. I don't like any of that. Like, whatever random card is here, I want that. Oh, the six I could have grabbed. Two, five. It's not gonna be better than two pairs, so that works. Hey, Chadley. Uh, yeah. King. Eat. But she took. King? That's even better. Just score that. I, maybe the six was there, but I didn't notice. Five nine, nope. I don't want to get ahead though. No. No jack. Yeah, I'll try twice this and the next one for a jack. Yes, give me the jack. Two, four, six, eight, seven. Seven, five. Now, that'll actually work. That was pretty lucky. King three. I don't see anything good there. Seven, eight. Lay them straight. <laughs> okay. Five, six, seven, four. Eight or three? No. Two chances left, so I might as well go for it. There's a three. Three, four, five, six, seven. That plus first place definitely gets the target. Awesome. I don't know. It's not that interesting, but... You know, they just threw it in here, so why not? I think there's a couple other weird modes. Maybe? No, that was it. Mini games. That's right. I don't know that I'm going to touch these. Maybe I'll do these together. <laughs> um, let's see what time is it. It's 11. Oh 
Luigi when it comes to Blackjack. I guess let's check one of these out. Let's do soccer. For no good reason. It feels it feels better to do them all together in a stream, especially like if anyone actually watches the archive. I don't know. Try to score ten goals, tilt and steer your Wii remote to kick the soccer balls into the goals. You don't say. Aiming at the last second is what's usually hard about this. It kind of tilted right at the last bit. <laughs> Hearing goal is really annoying. I didn't I didn't play this game for the mini games, I can promise that, but Ooh, almost didn't hit the ball. I did not hit the ball. Uh, it doesn't count. But that's really fast. Time bonus. I would have only needed... I probably would have needed all of that. Do it again. Really fast. Like, you don't want to go... I don't want to go too fast to aim bad. But you get a bonus point for every second. Oh. Like, then fast is the only way that's going to save it. Hey, that's like the same thing. Ooh, an extra point. I just want to restart. What? I don't know what it is with the last three, apparently. You just... I just get out of the rhythm? It doesn't look like they're at any different angle than any, uh, any of the others. Must... Must be somehow, but... Well, it's more points than last time. Raid. Hi, Wii U. Hi, Ben. I'm just gonna beat this right here without saying anything. Yes. Hopefully, I wasn't going too slow. Yes, 11 points. That's an S. Hey, GGP, a peachy pie. Thanks for the raid, Dingo Prime. Well, I'm sure we'll see you in a second. There we go, an S. It's weird, but, uh... Might as well have it in here, right? Shall we try bowling? Let's try bowling. Hey, Dingo Prime, thanks for the raid. Welcome to one of the weirdest games you'll ever see in your life. Try to bowl as many strikes as you can, tilt and steer your Wii remote to knock down the pins. And I'm pretty sure we're doing an actual game of bowling here as far as scoring goes. Strike. Awesome. While it lasts. Nine will work. No, oh, don't be sorry, Chadley. Thanks for coming by. I'm pretty sure extra time is still worth some points, but... 
I'm not gonna com compare to up to 300 points in bowling score. Nice. Two in a row. No one goes for spares in this game. Oh wow, that was nine? How was that a nine? Uh, you can change the music in Excite Truck if you put an SD card in, actually. Did I miss the pins? <laughs> Was there a set of pins I just missed? Wow, we're gonna need a lot more strikes. Yes, it is a lot of fun. I mean, it was a really long distance between the last set, so... Normal bowling, you would have had another throw. I mean, yeah, I just get a strike. Oh, no, you're right. You're right. You're very right. You gotta earn the third ball. I'm only focused on points. Not how the game works. Whew. Four in a row. Yes. Uh-oh. Dude, that wasn't so good. Now we're going to get three shots. All the strikes are worth less now. Oh my god, I only need four po I only need four pins. And that was another strike, 206. Plus a few bonus points. Look at all the strikes. 222. More fun than it should be, probably. Let's see. I had to stay to watch bowling, awesome. Scorpion, if you want a scorpion. Uh, let's do the red bar, because it's awful. <laughs> How can you even screw up the red bar? Don't push yourself too hard? What? I missed what it said. Don't push yourself too hard. Yeah, it's not a Nintendo game at all. Oh, this isn't like a regular red bar that stops at 10. It's just a timer. Oh my. Oh my god. <laughs> There better be bonus points. That's all I gotta say. That was exhausting. Okay, add the 15 to it. Perfect. Once is enough. <laughs> I was rotating the Wii Remote exactly like you saw on the screen. <laughs> That's stupid. Dingo Prime. Uh, let's do this one, because I find this one hard. I think. Keep your balance on the rail. Move the Wii Remote upward at the end of the ramp to get the music notes. Gonna get a run onto it, and then we gotta balance, and then go up. Like that. Um, how am I focusing on this? Yeah. 
How much time was there left? I think that'll do it. By a point! <laughs> oh, I did all but one of them. It's hard to... I don't know, if, you, if you're not tilted straight, you lose speed, and if you don't pull up really fast. During a race, I find it hard to get the top one. <laughs> well... Let's do this one. Why not? Try to snatch the stars from every hand. Did you know that you need to tilt and steer your Wii remote? Didn't figure that out yet. Oh, you lose time if you get hit. In addition to getting stunned. kind of like this one. Fun. Like minus five points getting hit, because that's points. I'm in trouble not getting hit. Damn, I thought I was out of the way then. Two of them. I'm not even gonna make it. Barely. Oh my god, yes, barely. I had never said this wasn't a Nintendo game, Iwata produced this. If you can angle, steer one way and then kind of fake it out. In some way. Damn it, right to where his thumb was. Well, I just didn't say that. Funny to say it's Master Hand, though. I think if we just go fast, we'll still get hit. It's better, but it's not. It's 59 points. Not sure what to do about that last one. Almost. Big improvement. No need to take a hit early. Miss the stars. I don't want to keep going though. Not now. Good. I thought the thumb was gonna hit me. Come on.
Oh, nice. In 25 seconds. Awesome. I could have gotten like... I could have just missed one star, I think. But I think pretty much getting hit by any of those hands, you're kind of screwed from getting an S. I think that probably will do it for me. <laughs> I didn't think I'd be doing these mini games. I've done half of them. Okay. Next time I play this game, we'll do Super Excite. I'm guessing it might not be tomorrow, though. <laughs> but yeah, the sequel to the sequel to my favorite Wii game. Now you've seen what it looks like. Um, we'll just, maybe we'll just end it. Or, what the hell? It must be Game Boy game. It must be Game Boy Day. Because I played Super Mario Land earlier. I saw other people playing Game Boy games or rated someone playing Pokemon Red. And now someone else is playing Pokemon Red. So let's go say hi to them. <laughs> Flapper is playing Pokemon Red. Also blind. The other person who was playing it had never played it. How is that even possible? I have no idea. But copy the hashtag and paste it over there. And I will see you hopefully tomorrow night. Good night for now though. <laughs>